one, this time Michael's from MichaelsonMichaelson.com. Sorry about that little glitch under there, but I forgot to turn my phone off and someone pulled me up and so I had to answer it. Anyway, um, today is the eve of the holiday of tabernacles. And the holiday of tabernacles, as you can see over here, we kind of built these huts, which is not really a hut, but we decorate it and we decorate it in the theme of Aladdin and the Arabian Nights. You can see around over here. My kids did a really nice job decorating it. We even made a little chandelier on top of there. And here's Abu and the magic lantern for the genie. And the interesting thing about this holiday is that this is a holiday where you kind of live as if. Now we've all heard about living as if when you're trying to do manifestation and you're supposed to live as if you had what you wanted already. And when you start living as if you had it already, then your unconscious mind starts to believe that you do have it and then it actually kind of manifests it. Now the interesting is this week I was sharing with a friend of mine a story from way back when, when I first got divorced. When I first got divorced, I was actually really pretty poor and I had around five or six friends who took me out for to the cafe, to the shop, to the um, dinner, you know, to make me feel better because I was in a really bad place over there at that time. And I was really bad because I couldn't repay them. I didn't have the money to repay them because I was really pretty poor. But at that time, they had a special sale on yogurts where if you bought a certain type of yogurt, which is one of the yogurts that my son just happened to love, one of my sons, and if you collected eight of those tops, you got a free coffee and cake and a certain coffee shop. And so I decided, all right, this is my opportunity. He loves the yogurts. I'm gonna get those tops. It's a double thing. I'm gonna do it, splurge over here. And I ended up getting 96 tops because I took six friends out, each one separately, and each time it was me and them. So it was like 12 tops, or no, it was eight tops for each one. So it was 16 tops for each time we went out. And even though I had to collect those tops and wash them and count them and make sure I had enough and all that, when I took them out, I don't think I ever felt richer than I did at that point. And that's kind of the idea of living as if, making yourself feel rich, even if you're not necessarily rich, make yourself feel, because when you start to believe that you have all those things that you want, then you'll actually get it. Most people go the opposite. They'll say, when I see it, I'll believe it. But when it comes to manifestation, you have to first believe it, and only afterwards are you gonna see it. Hi there, Sam. And so this is a holiday where we're, we're actually as if, we're all acting as if we're out in the desert because this is the type of huts, well, not really this type of hut, but they lived in huts or tents when they're out in the desert for 40 years, going out of Egypt and get going towards the land of Israel. And so we celebrate seven days. We eat out here every day. Some people actually sleep out over here. Since we get tend to get slugs, I don't like to sleep out here. I sleep in my own bed and also women don't have to sleep here in any case. So I'm cool with that. Uh, but we will eat over here. And it's actually a really nice holiday. It's like a holiday of being outdoors, being outdoors with friends and with your family. And even though this year we're not really with friends because of the lockdown, we can't really have the friends over, but my whole family's with me, all my kids. So for that, I'm still really grateful to lockdown. I wasn't supposed to have them for this holiday, but I still got them because of lockdown. So I'm sorry for those people who are sick, but I thank the lockdown. And I just want to wish all of you to have a great weekend wherever you are in the world. If you're celebrating the holiday, have a wonderful holiday. And even if you can't go out on trips like we usually do, we usually go on hikes next week because the holiday is seven days long where there's a holiday where you have to, you can't go out, then five days holiday you can go out and do things, then another holiday that's like a Sabbath that you can't go out. So usually we would go out hiking and camping and this year we're going to be home, but that's okay because we're going to all be together and we're going to have fun and we'll watch movies and we'll play games. And the important thing is the together time, in my humble opinion. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. Have a wonderful weekend to everyone over there. Remember, I'm here to make the whole world happy 1% of the time, starting with myself and to keep as many couples as happily married as I can. Things are always working out for me. Take care. Glamadison.com.